Alrighty guys, it's Intel. We're playing Assassin's Creed Valhalla. This is part four, and I'm super hyped. We get a crazy boss battle, and yeah, I hope you guys enjoy. You destroyed my life. Alrighty guys, we are back where we left off. We need to go speak to Third. Where is he at? Oh, he's at the top. So we took over this base, if you guys remember. That was pretty easy. It wasn't too hard. Aha! I didn't even see the ladder. I was like, we gonna, we gonna, we gonna have to climb that or what? Eivor, you missed the opening act. Kurtve's forward camp melted like a spring thaw at our approach. Is it from here we launch our attack? We do indeed, and we are ready to fight. King Harold's forces are well in place. Only give the word. I will, but before we strike, I have a request. Name it. The neighbor may give challenge to Kyrtve at the gate of his fortress. A battle to the death in single combat. Is... is this what you want? Kyrtve robbed my father of all honor and dignity. I will win it back. When honor is at stake, let none interfere. And if Kurtwis should die before the battle begins, all the better for our chances. Today my blade must do the work of Skuld's sharp scissors and cut short the cord of Kurtwis' fate. Well said. Right, that's the only thing that would be worst. correct to say. May we all live to hear that saga song. Alrighty, so we're going into battle. Eivor, a word. Basim, Hytham. This feud is not yours, yet you fight it all the same. I find that strange. You find it strange because you are wrong. Our clan, the Hidden Ones, have been fighting with Kyotve's order for centuries. You came from Miklagard to kill Kyotve yourself. We did. Or rather, we came so that Hytham could kill him. My apprentice has been studying this target for many months. Is Kyotve's reputation so great outside Norway? Not his reputation alone, but the order to which he belongs. Something of a rival clan to our own. Hytham, I mean no disrespect to you or the Hidden Ones, but Kyotve is mine. My family's honor is at stake. I understand. All that matters is that Kyotve dies this day. On that, we are agreed. Alrighty, bet. Sigurd Horsson. Slink around my walls like a thief in the night. Face me here now. The fight is mine, Kjotve. Sigurd is only here to watch me feed your innards to my raven. Look at this. <laughs> Once again, Abel Wilmkist appears to take a swipe at me. This. This is my father's shame. Today I take back the honor he lost. I call a home gang! Here! That is a big guy. I'm being so serious. Oh, I'm excited. We're about to rip this dude. Squeal as your mother squealed. You destroyed my life. I will take yours. You are weak, like your father was weak. Oh my gosh. Okay. You dance better than you fight. All right. He's no joke. What's going on? He ran away. Oh no. 
My blade will drink your blood. There's no your way. Will feed my wolves. Yeah, all his attacks are heavy. Oh. Oh, stun attacks are crazy. All right. That was the chance to stun him, and I messed up. Come on. Come on, baby. What is he doing? Oh, I thought he was about to put us into, like, I don't even know. You are your father's child. Holy. Oh. All right. That's right, baby. Come get. Uh huh. Uh huh. That's right, baby. Nothing. No. My plan will not be forgotten. I fought as I did, as hard as I did, to survive, for I know what awaits us in the end. Only darkness. <laughs> what? Clan, your lives are forfeit. Come forward if you must into the crucible of your doom. Your father is dead, Gorim. His debt repaid. Open the gates and you will be spared. Wallow in shit, wolf kissed. Archers, take aim. Ravens, show no mercy. Archers, fire. Why did I think he was just going to open the door? Alright, bro. They're not even paying attention? What's going on? What's he doing? Uh-huh. Catch that. Catch us too, baby. Oh, I'm supposed to unlock the gate. All right, let's go unlock that gate for us. Odin is with us. 
That's got to feel like... You got to feel like a boss, man. Like, knowing that you're a Viking and, like, Odin's with you type stuff. What I thought, fool. Oh, who's this? That's right, baby. Oh, that was brutal. Here we go. We gotta open the gates. I'm up. Get off me. Uh-huh. They don't even send a chance, to be honest. We're just... Alright, bro. Oh, we missed a lot of stuff. We'll have to go. I'll have to go back and collect it. Is that a weapon? Seventy attack. All right, right now we're using this. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try our, our other shield that we got. Alrighty, we're moving. A blind pursuit of vengeance has made you predictable. You are a shadow of your father, Gorn. Weak and witless. And you will leave this place as ashes on the wind. Sure, buddy. There's no way this dude ran away. <laughs> Eivor, we have the day. Let the coward... Eivor, the breath of battle rises from my brow. The skulls will sing of this night. We have won the day. But Gorm escaped and fled north to King Harald's domain. Let that bruised piglet run where he may. His father is dead. His clan is no more. We are the masters of Ria Vilke. A toothless cub may grow to be a dangerous wolf. Eivor, stop and listen. You have reclaimed your honor. Enjoy the night's victory. Tomorrow, we will celebrate. You're right, brother. You're always right. What about our assassin that got bodied? Like, did he die? I news of our victory to your nephew, the king. I have done so already, Sigurd. You'll be more than pleased. I will ensure you pride of place at his Alving at Alrikstadir. Tell him we will come. Battle first and singing songs of glory. Keep company with kings and you will soon have a crown of your own. <laughs> if the fates have spun it so, linger here and loot what you can. I will bring news of our victory to father before he leaves for Harald's Alving. I 
know soon. Another time. We got tons of skills. We're just going to do fate. Let fate decide. All right, sick. Where do we get to go? Let me see. Back to... Oh, no. That's actually kind of far. We're going to go all the way around. Type deal. Alrighty, guys. I'll see you guys there. Alrighty, guys. On our way there, I did a little pit stop. I um, Right now, I'm showing you all the stuff that we got trying to get there. I, you know, discovered some buildings, made sure I got all this loot and whatnot. And we did get, we got one more checkpoint. And that's about it. So, yeah. Enjoy the montage. Alrighty, guys, we are back. Have you ever seen so many ships dock at once? Never. Nor has there been a gathering of kings so long Kinda as this. Kind of missed the dock there, but it's okay. Who am I speaking to? Stretch your wings, Sunan. I see. Is a foul stench. You've just won your heart's desire, Eivor. Yet, by the look on your face, you've lost your will to live. Gorm is here with the last of his men. Why does that troll dare show his face? Leave it for another day. We are here under Harald's truce, and Gorm is too weak to try anything bold. He is a seed stain on his father's trousers. I should wipe him from this world. Not tonight, Eivor. Leave it. Basim, watch over this one and see that he warms himself with drink. I will find my father and escort him to the longhouse. As you wish. Is Hytham well? He will heal, but never fully recover. It is fortunate that you were able to succeed where he failed. My resolve was strong. When you slew Kyotve, did you see a sigil on him? Silver, the size of my palm, bearing the symbol of an ash tree? Take it. Trade it for what you can. I know where Gorm is camped. If you wish to see him without anyone the wiser, there is a trick I can teach you. Already looking for another princess? All right, I'll bite. What do I do? Use your cloak to obscure your face. Blend into the crowd. Divert attention. Hide in plain sight. A gift of knowledge from a man I hardly know. Is this your way of asking me to join your brotherhood? Not at all. So long as men and women fight to secure honor and freedom, religions hardly matters to me. I suppose there's no shame in using deception when honor is at stake. 
And Gorham is a stain on that honor. Then let's see what can be done to cleanse that stain. Give it a try. A few things you should know before you step into his camp. Walking unseen through hostile territory is an exercise in subtlety. What? We're going to be able to walk through hostile? Nah, that's crazy. A hood makes you forgettable, dismissed at a distance. Remain far from watchful eyes and you will be invisible to them. Do not draw blade or hammer, for these and other sudden movements can break your disguise. Oops, that's not... Look at us, we're all cloaked up. And in case I wasn't clear, you will need to put up your hood for the trick to work. Gorm is there, in the camp ahead. What were you thinking? Drinking mead on an empty stomach? Uh, you have to eat something before drinking that much. How does that go? No way. We almost got caught up quick. I'm on the spit. Are you coming? How much do you think? Eivor! You are your shit! Take up your weapon and follow me beyond these walls. Let Odin's favor land where it may you dare not break the king's peace here so fuck you and your god talk what say you to that hey <laughs> you can beat me but you will not kill me not under harold's truce you are all subject to king harald's truce Break his peace, and you will be cast out of Alrikstad. I will give you no trouble. You were shed into this world without honor, Gorm, and you will leave as a turd dumped into hell's deepest ditch. Keep growing, Eivor. You only make yourself an easier target. The old thing will have started. I should find Sigurd. That was crazy. So, we can use... We do have a cloak now. In a way. I mean, we've been using it. I've been using it. Why is that guy just eyeballing me? Leave me alone. Hey, how do I get up here? I'm doing all this. Looks like it's right here. Can I kill this dude? Yeah, but I don't really want to. Tell me Gorm still lives, Eivor. It pains me to say. He does. Thank you. His day will come. Oh, gods. I hate long speeches. Only when you're not giving them. Many of you knew my father, Halfdan the Black. A great man who achieved great things. They buried Halfdan's leg near our temple. The crops have never grown taller. <laughs> they buried his arse near ours, and we get nothing but a muddy river. I dream of something greater. 
A vast kingdom of warriors in numbers the world has never seen. United under one king, one rule. Too much blood has been spilled fighting one another. Today, we unify and turn our blades outward to conquer new lands. And who better to lead us to glory than me? I was blotted before the age of ten, and I led the greatest army Norway has ever seen. But they say a wise king seeks honest counsel, so I ask, who among you rejects this new arrangement? I am not your enemy, King Harald, but I will not be your subject. Tomorrow we sail for greener shores, and so my kingdom is yours. This saddens me, noble girl. And does your wife agree? Is she not tired of limping ever westward? My husband and I are as one in this, Lord. We do not limp together. We fly. I'm sad to lose a woman of your spirit, Yuvina. But I hold no grudge. May the fates grant you good luck. My king! I offer you my axe and my oath, ironclad. Gorm Kjotveson, you dare show your face in this hall. Did not King Styrbjorn and his son Sigurd rid our lands of your foulness? The Raven Clan dishonored me, great king. They poisoned my father, Kjotve. They made a mockery of his honorable death. Bakrav, you lie! Hold, Eivor. Let it play out. This is a serious charge, Gorm, and a false one at that. My uncle saw your father die. Eivor Wolfkist, you are Kjotve's slayer. This man has slandered your clan. What shall I do with him? You are king of these lands, Harald. The decision must be yours. A modest and honorable answer. Gorm, I name you Worm and call you Exile. Leave these lands by the next full moon or I will feed you to the crows myself. Nice. That was a good choice. I didn't want to just kill him. King Harald. May I speak? The floor is yours, King Stebjörn. My people have held our land since the days when Odin himself walked among us. My kingdom is humble, but we have paid for it in blood. Our victory over Kjotve is proof that we will not lay down without a fight. All here have buried friends, brothers and sisters, sons and daughters. And I, for one, have had my fill of death. Let those who seek war look beyond our shores. If King Harold brings peace, then I am happy to bend my knee to him. What? What in hell's name are you doing, father? Securing a lasting peace, Sigurd. Our days of fighting are finished. You said nothing of this to me, not a word, and I will not yield a title that should be mine by right. Then war will continue. Men will die, villages will burn, you foolish boy. This is our only way towards true peace. You will die a thrall, you drink adult cow, alone and toothless in a bed of straw. Forgive my son. He is ruled by his emotions. I take no offense, Stebjörn Jarl, and I thank you for your fealty. It is natural to fear change, to resist it. But all things change and all things end. The lessons of Ragnarok are clear. We will speak again soon. That was an ambush, Lord. Did you know of Stupion's plans? For some days, yes, I did. But it was not at my urging. It was his decision alone. Do you dream of a glorious future, Eivor? A warrior like you would be a boon to my clan. All I know of fate is that its pattern is unknowable. I do not worry beyond that fact. I wish I understood you better. For those I do not understand, I do not trust, and I cannot stomach a lack of trust. You have nothing to fear from me, King Harald. 
My loyalty lies with my brother Sigurd, and I bear you no ill will. Then know that if you stay in Norway, both you and your brother must serve under me. Take tomorrow to think on this. But let us leave these matters for another time. Hmm. Tonight we will I don't know if I said the right thing. Gods and wake in a kingdom made new. Arrow's colors. He is already marking his territory. Marking? Gods, he's spraying like a horny pup. Harold may be young, but he's clever. Do not underestimate him. He came of age very quickly. Alrighty, two skill points. All right, we've unlocked some abilities. All righty, guys. I'm going to leave it off here. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in part four.